Hey guys, what's going on? I'm back with a new product review for you guys today and um, today I'm going to be reviewing and testing the newest film or instant film from uh, Polaroid Originals. This is the Color 600 film. Uh, you can find it on Amazon for about $19. And um, uh, yeah, Polaroid Originals of course are, are formerly known as the Impossible Project. Uh, they took over the classic Polaroid brand of cameras and instant film uh, a few months ago. And uh, uh, yeah, this is the 600 type uh, color film for classic 600 cameras. As you, as you can see here in the back, it has some information of the cameras that you can use. You can use them with the classic or what they call the vintage Polaroid 600 cameras, the vintage Polaroid Impulse cameras, and the new Polaroid I type that just came out, came out last year. Uh, some information here in the back about the development time. It takes about 10 to 15 minutes for the film to develop. I have used this uh, type of film in the past many times and I've been very happy with it. Uh, so I wanted to make sure I did a review. I keep buying this ones because I'm really surprised and happy with the results and I just wanted to make a review for you guys today. Uh, one thing to note about the, the box here in, the, in this side right here in the bottom of the box. You'll see a date here stamped in the back. I don't know if you can see it there but it says 12-17. Uh, this is the manufacturing date. Um, this was manufactured in um, December of 2017. I've seen some people complaining online or in Amazon in the comments saying that uh, they have received the expired film. Uh, this is not the expiration date. This is the manufacturing date and it says right there production date. So uh, this film is actually pretty new. Uh, just a few months old so it should work just fine. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and open this uh, pack of new film. Um, Again, uh, Polaroid Originals is the company that took over the classic Polaroid factories and cameras for their film and their uh, classic cameras as well for instant uh, pictures. And uh, yeah, I think they have done a really good job so far. I've been very surprised with the product or the pictures that I've got with this type of film. It comes in really nicely packed inside as you can see. It's very sealed just to make sure that the film is fresh when you open it. And they usually include some nice booklet in here saying how to make great photos, how to make great photos, not to take great photos, how to make great photos, and pretty basic information. If you're familiar with any type of photography or with instant photography, this would not be a surprise for you. you okay, so for the testing, I have brought my classic and handy Polaroid 600 camera. Uh, this is one of the, the later uh, models that came out for, um, for from Polaroid, the or original Polaroid back in the 80s, I believe, or the mid 80s. Has some quick tips here in the back of how to use, but you don't really need the, the tips. It's a fairly straightforward camera to use. Uh, just uh, pl uh, put in the film and then you're ready to shoot. It's um, strictly an automatic camera. Uh, so yeah, I'll show you how to put in the cassette inside. Very simple, just grab it, make sure that this thing, uh, the first film is in the top. And you fit it in, slide it into your camera. And I have tested this camera before with um, other types of film or with other films for the 600 camera and it works just fine so I know it works and you close it and the first slide or the first picture will come out which is the empty one of course if you have shot with Polaroid you will know that and then you're ready to shoot one quick setting that I do like to do with my 600 cameras is I do like to put them a little bit or have the exposure a little bit higher so it will take a little bit brighter photos so you can move this uh, button right here or this latch just a tiny bit because I like it to have uh, I like to have it um a little bit brighter um, just to avoid it uh, having dark pictures I guess uh, so yeah I'm gonna take this camera outside I'm gonna take a few pictures for you and I'll show you the results all right guys so I just came back uh, from a quick walk outside the studio just to test uh, the camera and the film and to take some pictures, as you can see right here are my results. I ended up taking four pictures of uh, just an area outside the, the studio. They have like an old building where they have like, um, uh, like an art center with like a metal works um, uh, shop. And it's pretty cool looking, as you can see. Here's uh, my first picture. I think it ended up uh, pretty good. Um, uh, and it's the classic film from, film from the uh, classic uh, Polaroid cameras and uh, film. Um, vintage kind of look, uh, kind of like the old timey look of the pictures. Uh, so you're not going to get like the high resolution pictures that you get with the other types of instant cameras or the newer cameras. Uh, but yeah, there's uh, here's the, the, my first result. I think it ended up pretty good. Uh, I love everything about the Polaroid uh, film and cameras, so I was very happy with this one, how this one came out. Um, 
Uh, the next one ended up a uh, uh, very uh, similar kind of look as well. Uh, this is a, an area in an aisle of, uh, also outside this, the, the, the building. And I think it ended up, ended up focusing the picture here in, the, in this um, lamp. And uh, everything else ended up a little bit uh, out of focus. But I like it. I like it how it ended up. And uh, yeah, this is my second picture. Also an area outside the Metalworks uh, shop. They have like a metal statue of a flower. Uh, not the best picture I've taken uh, compositionally, but I think it ended up looking really cool. Again, with the classic uh, uh, look of the Polaroid uh, images. And uh, one thing then to note about this one, I did uh, use the flash in this picture, so it ended up a little bit brighter here on the, on the, on the subject and a little bit darker here on the sides. Uh, really cool picture. And then at the end, I ended up taking a picture of this metal uh, bench outside, and I, I did not use a, um, uh, a flash uh, on this one. I've uh, gone through tons of this kind of packs of film, and I always ended up with really good results. Again, really highly recommend that you, uh, you check out the Polaroid Originals Company and this uh, Color 600 film. Uh, highly recommend it. I give it 5 out of 5 stars. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.